59, Paul Laurie. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome to the Open Zone, Paul. Well, thank you. Uh, nice to be we here. are going to talk about putting because you were renowned as being a great putter. Uh, but before we even get into the way you putt, show us this putter. This yeah, we're, we're, we're doing a putter that's the uh, 20th anniversary of my Open win uh, next year. So we've taken out a limited edition putter. It's got the claret jug on the heel there. We're doing 99 uh, of them, and the money will be raised to go to my foundation uh, back amazing. in Aberdeen. So Absolutely amazing. That'll Great be next year, they'll well. be for sale. Brilliant so. stuff. Uh, Paul, we're going to focus on something that, well, you know what, actually, it's going to affect the American players more than our players. We're going to talk about pace of putt. So they're okay, running yeah. at 10.1 today on the golf course. Um, this mat, we've got the Zen stage here running at 10. It's a right edge putt. So first of all, just talk us through a couple of things that you focus on with your putting and just knock it in. I mean, the fact we're only going to hit a couple of putts, we've brought quite a few balls just in case. Okay. You know, it doesn't go to plan, but it will, it'll be fine. We will use all of those <laughs> for me to get that in there. You know that as well as I do. But no, I mean, obviously, uh, when you, uh, back in the day, I, I was always a good putter. I always hold my fair share of putts. You don't realise how hard a game it is until you start missing, you know, your fair share of putts. And it puts a lot of pressure on your game. But, uh, you know, back in the day, this kind of, I hold a lot of putts of this sort of range. I was always very good at the mid-range type putts. And I see it. I've, I, have a, I have a way that I, I always, my, my poor putts, I lift the putter up. So I always have a feeling where I go low on the way back yeah. and then I, I hold my follow through because I had a little bit of a recoil for a while with the putter. Yeah. So I always feel the pace of the putt better yeah. when I feel it low because when it goes low, it then goes high on the way through automatically. Right. So when I pick it up, I hit down on it and it ball bounces. So I try and go low and then hold is only two things that I think about. I'm trying to get it just behind the hole. 18 inches, couple of feet behind the hole is ideal. This one's about a right edge, is it? This, is, this looks just about right edge to me. Well, go so on. We'll... This is a running at the same speed as these greens in Carnoose. So you knock okay. it in, pull first go, that would be fantastic. You nervous? I am actually, can you tell? <laughs> oh, yes, oh. yes. Um, Never doubted you for a second, Paul. Never doubted you. <laughs> what we're going to do, though, we're going to tip the Zen stage. So if we can lift that now at the back, we're going to move these to 13 on the stint meter, which is, a you know, the PGA Tour players in particular yeah, yeah. will face that week in, yeah, yeah. week out. We know the conditions on the fairways are different. The greens are very different speed-wise. And you think, well, the challenge is you've got to get the ball to the hole. Mm -hmm. Is that the only challenge, though, when, when you get the speed changing? The exact same putt as it was before, but it's quicker now. Anything, anything that's a little quicker, it tends to break a little more. Obviously, it just insinuates the actual break of the putt. So I always feel as though I'm aiming at something sort of not quite halfway along, but you're trying to get something to go to a certain point and then fall. And yeah. the more break and, and the, the quicker the putt, slightly more break comes into play on it. But more, this is pretty much straight down, but it's a little right to left. So it's just going to be a little bit more of a break on it right to left. Go on, let's see it's it A little then. quicker. So by lowering the blades of the mower, they can change the amount that the putt will turn. Oh, you can see that amount of break. Yeah. Come on, Paul, it'll be day two of the open scene. Come on, come on. Like, this is the last Starting go. Starting to feel bad for this, me already. <laughs> this is the last go. Come on, let's hear it for oh, Paul. Come on, Paul, knock it in. Go on, go on, go on, go on, go on. Oh, just right in the middle. The most Thank important you. thing, when you knew it was the last chance, you delivered, Absolutely. just like you did in 99. That's always well the way, Paul. isn't it? Thank you. Amazing. 